All right, what's good? What's happening? What's cracking, everybody? It's your boy Kiji, and welcome back to another episode of Kiji Plays. Here I am, my homie Sam, and we're going to be testing out Wrath and showing you all his moves and how to use them. All right, so first things first, Wrath's not that fast. He runs, this is his run speed, can't really run faster than this in his regular form. Jump height's pretty solid, not that bad. It can get you out of tough situations if you're getting attacked. Uh, it's not super high. I think uh, forearms jumps a little bit higher, actually. But actually, I'm going to show you his moves and test the damage. So first things first, Wrath has this smack attack, the same one as Rip Jaws. Does decent damage to a regular person, but it, it, the crazy thing about it is the knockback and the sound. Okay, so Sam, yeah, come on back this way. Thank you very much, sir. And this is my homie Sam Flynn Lives. Uh, he's a friend of mine I've known for a little while, and he's just helping me out for this video. All right, so next we have his E attack, and this E attack is kind of interesting. So it, he charges towards somebody and says, let me tell you something, but it also increases his attack, speed, and damage. See how fast I killed that guy, killed Sam. So, and once... After maybe, I don't know what the actual timing is, but after a while, he does a shockwave that knocks back anybody around him. Let me see if it'll go off soon. It should be going off pretty soon here. Uh, I think. Maybe it's broken. I don't know. But that the way that attack goes, you your attack speed goes up. You charge at a specific person. And there's a knockwave afterwards. But I think it's currently glitched right now, meaning why it hasn't gone off. But that's okay. I think I could do it again. No, I can't. Huh. Interesting. Either way, smack and his, his smack and his uh, dash attack are really his main things that he has. Uh, and it doesn't change once he goes into his ultimate form. Only thing that does change is his run speed and jump height. He jumps way, way higher. And it's crazy. Way higher than, I think, even regular forearms. Maybe about the same as regular forearms. I don't know. Because regular forearms jumps pretty, pretty high. All right, so let me see if I can get that E off uh, attack off again since I am in my ultimate form now. No, it just it's just broken. Hmm, interesting. Well, you guys get the gist of what Wrath does. He's not that complicated of an alien in comparison to everybody else. He's strong. He does really, really high damage, especially in his, like, ultimate form. See, I just me virtually melted his health away. And he's about as strong as forearms. And I always use forearms for reference because he's a solid starter alien that's really, really strong if you want to attack somebody. But he's way faster. So this is... Imagine seeing something like this running at you with, you know, killer intent. That's terrifying. And his jump height's crazy. His jump height is super, super nuts. But yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. If there's any other aliens that you guys want me to break down. I did this as a request from one of my friends from Discord. I wasn't planning on doing alien breakdowns uh, per se. It wasn't something on the front of my list. But I'll probably start to do those if we get more requests for them in the future. If you like this video, go ahead and leave a like. If you want to see more, go ahead and subscribe. It's been Keegan. I'll see you guys later. Peace.